Okay, here's the uh, tiller and skipper design for Penobscot 14. We cut it out of uh, quarter inch layers of uh, cypress and quarter inch plywood. We attached it with the uh, tiller straps that are found on a uh, newer model sunfish. It can tilt up and down, so she's up back in this little horseshoe area and she wants to slide underneath, she can. Put it back down. It's got an up haul. Now we just left the rudder all wood, so normal conditions, it would float up, but once we get on land, we want something to hold it up so the line just goes right through the yoke, back down and down to the blade. Now once it's down, because it does float, we ran another line from the forward edge of the blade up the front of the rudder head into the cockpit and see that. Here it is, so when you're out sailing, you just want to pull the blade down, just pull on this. You get it the angle you want, you just cleat it in there. Use the fancy uh, hired cleat off a of sunfish. As for the hand pull, the uh, hardware is made by Port Townsend Foundry out of silicone bronze. The uh, rudder stock or the yoke, whatever you want to call it, is uh, the uh, quarter inch marine grade Akume plywood with the cypress uh, center. So we tried it up a couple of different configurations. And I found that this works best for us. So there it is. We like to have it on when we're rowing, so Skipper can sit in the back and and steer while I row. And then it's easy enough to remove it. lay it inside the boat for storage which is what we're getting ready to do next it's our 14 foot Penobscot 14 St. Jacques designed by Arch Davis this is a plan in hole number 1333 hope y'all are having a good day